Hi everyone, it's Kim. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. Today I am bringing you another weekly welcome to my 2021 journey, I guess is what we're going to call it. I'm not still trying to play with the name of how we're going to call this video series, but here's my weekly updates for you. And I think that's probably the easiest way. I needed some accountability in 2021, so I'm taking you along for the ride. We're going to keep the same format. I'm trying to, I'm just, we're just winging this. I, there's no script. I do have a list of things that I want to cover with you, but I'm just winging this as we go through. So I have my dinners this week. I have my dinners last week. I'm going to give you the recap on that. I'm also going to talk to you about my weight change. Did it go up? Did it go down? Hmm. Also the books I'm reading, my water and workout habits, and my home updates. So are you ready? Because we're going to dive right in. All right, so my dinner menu last week. Let's kind of, let's go there first. So last week I was going to do white chicken chili, chicken tacos, cheeseburgers, chicken and bean burritos, and a turkey breast or turkey club sandwiches. So how many meals did I make out of those? Zero. Yes, you heard that right, zero. So what did we have? That's the question. On Sunday, we decided to grab some food from our local Mexican restaurant. So I got chicken fajitas, which kind of threw chicken tacos and chicken bean burritos because he had burritos. So that kind of threw that out the window. So I had to revamp my list last week. So I have my another list over here. So on Monday, we had Sloppy Joe's. On Tuesday, we had chicken club sandwiches and they were absolutely delicious. So I'm gonna end up, I'm gonna, we're gonna make those again. And when I do, I'll film that for you because it was so good. And even the non-WW husband loved them. On Wednesday, we had a chicken stir fry. On Thursday, he's on his own. So he and my granddaughter got dinner and I think I got them Wendy. Yeah, I stopped and got them Wendy's. And then I, since I had chicken stir fry left, I went ahead and had chicken stir fry that day. And then on Friday, we had pork chops. So I still cooked. It just wasn't cooking what I thought I was going to cook. All right. So this week, our menu is, are you ready? White bean chicken chili. I really want to make that. So hopefully I can get to that Monday. And then we're gonna have chicken tacos, spaghetti, and turkey breast. Now I do have, I'm off Monday, I'm teaching a class Thursday. I really only need four meals. So that's my plan this week. I'm going to film the white bean chicken chili because I hear it's really good. I can't wait to make it. It's a super simple recipe. And I'm filming the chicken fajita, the chicken fajita rice, I think is what it's called. Chicken fajita rice, I think that's what it's called. I'm filming that one today, later today. So we're having that for dinner tonight. And again, I already have everything pulled out for that. So I'm definitely gonna make that in the Instant Pot tonight. I know it's been on my radar for a couple of weeks, but it's just, I, I don't know about you, but sometimes things get out of hand with all the extra construction going on upstairs. It's it's kind of thrown us off a little bit. I think I if I didn't mention that before, this is a retake because I thought I was filming and I wasn't filming. So you got to like that. All right. So that takes care of our dinners last week. This week, I am going to film again my meal prep. If you haven't been catching those, definitely go back, look at my past videos. I have been meal prepping again for the second week in a row, packing my breakfast, my lunch, and my snacks. And I'm telling you, just the thing about not having to choose or think about my food during the day, game changer. I mean, I don't even know why I quit doing that. So I'm going to go ahead and do that again. So that brings me to my weight change. So did I win or did I win? Did I lose or did I gain? What do you guys think? I lost again. So I'm down another 1.2, which brings me, I think, to 2.7 pounds. I'll put my chart here. And 2.7 pounds, not bad to start the year off. I'm kind of, oh, yes. All right, so happy about the weight change. I hopefully, I will have another loss this week. I would, like I said, I would really like to get to back to my pre-COVID weight. And 
I, I just, I, I'm tired of dealing with it. I'm tired of looking at it. I'm tired of seeing it on the scale. So cross my fingers. I can continue on. We'll have another great week. So stay tuned. I will definitely bring you that update again next week. All right, books I'm reading. You guys wanted to know, so here it is. I told you last week that I was still reading the Mrs. Peregrine's Peculiar Children book three. I did finish that. It was super good. Had a great ending. I mean, a really good ending. So very excited about that. And I was also reading another book. I think I wrote it down just because I, I, the authors kind of get out of my way. So I'm reading, I was reading a book called Stillhouse Lake. And it's a five book series. Four of the five books are out right now. And I just finished book three. Super good. I, I'm reading that on my Kindle. So I'm downloading those books from Amazon. And super good. Um, edge of your seat. Very exciting book. So that one really recommended. Again, Rachel Kane is the author on that one. Taking a break. There's a book four and book five releases. I think I said in March. So I'm taking a break. I'm going to read another book that I had gotten and I'll, um, I'll take a picture and put it here. The name escapes me again. I just started it last night. I read one chapter and then fell asleep. So I've got that one going. Now, I did tell you last week that I was going to start the book Essentialism by Greg McCowan, and that is a book on tape. I am about an hour into the six-hour book on that one already. So a little changing it up. I usually read my Kindle at night and listen to the books on tape during the day or while I'm multitasking. So that's kind of my rhythm on my book reading. So that's where I'm at with my books. And I'll, I'll keep you posted on the book on my Kindle because I'm not far enough into it yet to even give you an opinion about it. All right, so what's next? My water habit and my workout. Again, my water habit was good this week. I can't say that I nailed it like I did last week because I don't think I was as focused. I did have a glass of water in front of me, but I held on to my coffee a little bit longer this week. Work was a little tough this week. I sat through a lot of meetings. I had a lot of testing to do. So with all of that, I really relied on my coffee a little bit more. I made soup during my meal prep. That's what I was having for lunch all week. Super good. Like super good. Make some soup, people. It is really good, especially this time of year. All right. So last update, my de decluttering and home updates. I made it through some more paperwork and I don't know about you, but when it's time to go through paperwork, you have to go through each and every piece that you have. And it is time consuming. I know that I have a big shred pile that I need to do. I did get rid of a lot more. So I put that into the recycle bin and it's coming along. I also pulled out some things. I'm going to try my hand at Facebook Marketplace. So if you have any tips for me, please leave them below. I've got a few things and I've got a couple of Wilton retired cake pans and I have one that is so retired that if you want to buy it new it's $68 on Amazon and I can't find it anywhere else. I, I did a search for it. I, I, I didn't spend a lot of time on it but it did show up as a $68 item and I'm like wow. So I'm gonna try to sell a few things on Marketplace. Otherwise, if they don't sell within a week or two, I'm just gonna put them in the donate pile and bless somebody else with them. I'm continuing to go through things as I see things, as I'm wearing clothes that I'm like, you know what, this really isn't my favorite. I'm washing them and they're going into the donate pile as well. So continuing to go through that and making progress. The bathroom. Let me get, let me kind of give you guys an update on the bathroom. The bathroom is coming along. I think tile is going to start going up tomorrow. Uh, we now have a floor. We have walls. Um, last week, I think when I gave you the update, we had everything. Well, we. <laughs> I've done nothing. It's it's all him. He had it pulled. He had it down to the bare studs. Um, say hello to Beast. He had it um down to the bare studs and. We now have walls, there's cement board, the lights are in. We got a fancy new um, fan. 
So it's a fan nightlight and it actually Bluetooth. So how fun is that? Technology people, our old fan just came on when you turned it on. So that's kind of cool. Uh, I've been playing with that. It's got a couple different, different, it's got like a yellowish nightlight and a blue nightlight. So it's very pretty. So that, the, that's as far as, I think that's as far as, he's got the lights in too. So the lights, the fan and walls are up now. Getting excited, he picked up the vanity. He, oh, what else has he done? Tub's in, tub's been in and out and in. So the tub is in now. And I picked out the accent tiles for the wall too. Getting excited. I, I don't know if you've ever done a project, but if you ever do projects, it's really exciting when you start to start see, you know, seeing things come together. I can't wait till it's done because <laughs> we've been running to the downstairs bathroom in the middle of the night to go to the bathroom. And when you're drinking tons of water during the day and still drinking it at night, there's a, there's a trip or two to the, to the basement to go to the bathroom. I mean, it's probably TMI, but there you go. All right. So don't forget, um, I'm going to wrap things up. I don't know how long I've been talking, but I'm going to wrap it up from here. Don't forget, give me a thumbs up. If you're liking this series, leave me some comments below. And I, I think that's it. I, I'm going to wrap this up and we will see you next video. Hi, busy boy.